Hey guys, so today I'm gonna try to make a video. I don't, I really don't know what I'm gonna do yet. I don't have much to do, but you know, know what's going on in the world. Try not to like spend too much money because I don't know what's gonna happen later. But, um, I have the mini in the backyard, I have a couple works that I need to do to it. And by the way, I have some parts for the mini. Hold on, I might just show you guys that one. So, I got a few. A, couple parts for it that got pieces still in the mail it didn't get here yet but in a second oh. all right so let's see what is this yeah so um Yeah, so I went ahead and picked up a pick up a JCW side skirt. Uh, I'm missing one piece. Hold on, let me take out everything. So yeah, I'm missing this piece right here. That's in the mail, and also the vent for these two parts. Yeah, but I didn't even put it next to the car to see. What this side is gonna look like and how low it's gonna sit. Uh, it's pretty crazy. It's gonna sit pretty low. It's so funny because <laughs> it's so funny. This part of the bumper, this is just up, you know, one piece. It's still got that like uh, black piece to like the liner underneath the bottom right here. But even this piece right here is much lower than the OEM Mini Cooper S side skirt. So that's pretty cool. So it's gonna probably sit like probably like somewhere down here that's gonna be low as well but yeah that's cool so today i think i'm just gonna like give the cars a wash and pretty much that's gonna be it and we over here chefing up some some stuff got some stuff right here yep and this lady over here what you doing Mm -hmm. What you doing? Making coconut rice. I'm here with my mod hunty. Say hi. Hi! Oh, I am still a girl. <laughs> <laughs> she just a world of trouble. <laughs> okay, so we got that on the fire. I'm gonna start washing the mini cooper.
guys. So we finished washing the car. It looks good. And um I bought this thing from um Advanced Auto Parts. Or yeah, Advanced Auto Parts. And it's like it's basically like um what's that thing called again? A clay bar, but it's like on this little thing that you hold you hold on to it. So what I did is uh I when the car was wet I just constantly dipped it. I dipped it in the bucket and uh scrubbed the car down a little bit and it just get out those little fine particles in the paint, you know. I'm not a big I'm not a a, a detail or anything like that, but you know, I was watching a couple of videos on it. it. It helped so I did it. And I could tell the difference cuz when you when you just starting it, you can feel it. It's like grabbing the whole thing like you, you know like when you're rubbing something against something it's like friction but after a while you can just feel it loosen up and you can after you finish that section you rub your hand over it and then you go to an unfinished section and you rub your hand over it and you can tell the difference it's like a significant difference but i wanted to do the fiat also when the subi but this this thing is time consuming uh, i'm tired and i wanted to do i was gonna do the fiat anyways but it's the sun came out and if you know anything about washing the car in the sun it's a nightmare because as soon as you put the the soap on it it, it dries on there and it's just not what i'm looking for so i'm just gonna wait until later on down in the day and i may or may not do it so we'll see how that plays out you know and today was supposed to be cloudy that's what they said but it's not cloudy it's sunny and i got this thing on the fire here not looking too bad you know I don't know if you guys can see it so that's going and i'm just chilling out here and um i found this um product i saw it um this youtuber guy he reviewed it and it looks good so um it's basically for plastic trims i'm gonna get it and i'm gonna have to wash the car again and coat it with it I have this little thing that I normally use on it. Every time I wash the car, I'll put it on there. But it really doesn't stay long. Like as soon as like a you know if it, if it rains or anything, it wash off or you wash the car, it come off or whatnot. But that one stayed on it for like it says six months. So we're gonna see. The dude that use it, we don't know who it is, you know, but it looks good when he did it. So I'm gonna try it with this car. And I'm also thinking about removing these plastic dips and like get like vinyl wrap or something to that to this, to that start or take them off and paint them black so the car have a more nicer look but the only thing i'm worried about is that the side panels they're gonna be i'm not gonna paint those so i don't think the color is gonna change much and i don't want these to stand out like glass you know glossy and then this thing is like matte black i don't know so I'm gonna play around with that and see what happened. But you know, I'm gonna be chilling for the rest of the day. And if I, you know, start working on the other car, I'll just pick the camera up or whatnot. So I guess I'll just, you know, you guys will see what happened. Like I said, if I do anything else, I'll pick up the camera. But there's not much to do. You know, this quarantine thing is like really just holding us down. You know, work slow, so we can't just spend unnecessary money or whatnot, you know. So we're just trying man. It is what it is. We just you know it's just a regular day in the life so alright so I'll catch up with you guys later. Okay guys so a little while ago I decided I'm gonna clean up the Fiat and I also cleaned up the Subaru. I just give that one a regular wash sitting over there all nice and pretty and this car is all clean now so my boy just called, he said he wanted to go for a nice little stroll, you know, afternoon quarantine drive, I guess. So, I'm gonna wrap up here. And then when we hit the road, I might pick up the camera and see if I can get some footage for you guys. So, I'm gonna wrap up everything here and then, yeah, mini looking clean too. And the biggest difference I saw in the, um, the clay bar thingy, I mean, looks wise, it's Pretty much you're not gonna see anything but feel it when you feel it you'll see you'll feel a big difference in there because it you feel like sandy before and then after it feels smooth the fiat now because it's a white car he had a lot of like little black like 
pitting inside of the paint so when you rub it out you you saw it you see it come out and you'll see like the the water is getting dirty when you start scrubbing it so i guess it was worth it so it took a long ass time though so i'm gonna wrap up here and then i'm gonna pick up the camera and one more last look we are sitting over here sitting over there and the subi's all over there I and mean, later on you guys will get shot at the subi we're gonna just take the subi today yeah so i'll pick up the camera when i'm done here